Hey guys, welcome to Thirsty Thursday. Today we're going to be doing a smash bear with a golden premise. And we are going to be hopping them with the unknown mystery hop that the label fell off. Oh my god, I hope that they're uh, good. And we're not even going to be brewing to style. Booyah! Let's rock and roll! Got a go on promise there. Um, I'm gonna put uh, seven liters strike water. It's very um, seed of your pants. This I'm uh, developing the, rec uh, the recipe as we go, so um, it's gonna be a overnight mash. I'll do a I'll do a 120 minute mash or maybe 60 minute mash and just leave it overnight, and it should be uh, good. Um, it's really just using up some old stuff that I've got. Um, get it out. Um, this should be okay. I tried a few. Uh, I tried a few grains before. It's a little bit chewy, which is a little bit concerning. Maybe a little bit of air got into it, but uh, oh well, we'll see. It's really just to th throw it together and see what sticks. Sort of, sort of, sort of smash. So um, yep, be back after that. Welcome back guys, so we've got the uh, strike water 70, looking for a single infusion light body, uh, American ale type beer, so uh, it's um, spot on. Five hundred mils of uh, five hundred grams of uh, Golden Promise going in. And uh, I might, um, I want to do a 90 minute mash, but I might do a 60 and then I'll do the old uh, iodine conversion test as you do. And um, I'm looking for a lovely straw colored uh, wart with that one. Put the old lid on. Beautiful, beautiful. Should be good. And um, I'll leave that. And I'll come back when the mash is over. Cheers. Welcome back, guys. Just uh, done the old sugar conversion test. And uh, reasonably pleased with that. It's been in just over an hour. Yeah, I'm pretty uh, satisfied that that's done a full conversion. I'm going to, uh, it's a better angle, pull that uh, bag out. Um, and uh, I'll do the boil tomorrow. Um, I'm going to treat the hops uh, like they're a bittering hop. I've narrowed it down. I've had a look through my inventory on uh, Bearsmith. And they're either Simcoe or Admiral. Um, if it's Admiral, I'm going to uh, well, I'm going to play it safe. I'm just going to use them as bittering pops. I'm probably only going to add about uh, five six grams um, to that. So I'm only doing a five one gallon five liter batch. So um, I'm going to pull the pin on that, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for the uh, boil and yeah. So. See you in 24 hours. Cheers. 24 hours later. Welcome back, guys. Next day. Jug on. Coffee ready. Boil kit on. Boil kettle on. Let's rock.
I'm downstairs now, I've uh, just put that uh, wart in the uh, bath to cool down. And I'm just going to set the old uh, temperature control. I might uh, do about 18, I think. No, inky birdie. Should do it nicely. I got some uh, reclaimed yeast here, the USA 5. Um, I'll put that in the in the fermentation chamber just to uh, warm it up a bit, get it up to uh, pitching temp. And I've just pitched the slurry. Get my hand out of the camera, away the camera. And she's in there nicely. Tucked away, the old mystery hop smash. Uh, pow -ow. So I've got that fermenting about 18 degrees and um, went pretty smoothly. I might give that 14 days and then I've only done, um, as I say, I've only done a, a, a gallon, uh, five litres. Uh, I was talking to a bloke on uh, Facebook about you Americans and your refusal to go to metric. <laughs> get with the times! Imperial! <laughs> um, so, uh, yeah. Give that 14 days. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, cheers for watching Thirsty Thursday. Uh, check out my other videos and um, get engaged. Get into that uh, Facebook group. Cheers.